What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's Dan here. I'd like to welcome you guys back to Far Cry 5. We are moving on. Just got saved. Glimmer of Hope is the next mission on the agenda. We're on Dutch's Island. We just got saved by Dutch. So, let us keep going. Got to change our clothes. This is where we get to kind of choose what we want to wear. Now, because I have the gold edition... I'm trying to remember who I end up picking. There aren't as many... I think this is the one I end up going with. And the palest skin color you can imagine. The hair choices are basically it's just different colored hair. It's hard to tell if that's black or if that's dark brown. That's black. Wait, is it? Yeah, well... It's honestly really hard to say. That, that looks black to me. And that looks like brown, but... That could be dark brown. It's honestly hard to tell. Unless this is gray. That looks kind of gray. That looks brown. I say that's going to be our best bet for color. So we just got to pick a style we like. Kind of limited here as well. Oh god, at first it looked okay until I rotated. It's a mullet. It's horrible. I think we'll roll with this color, this, this hairstyle. Choices are final. Yeah, I'm okay with that. All right, upper body. These are also quite limited at the moment. Blue sleeveless, why not? It's hot out there. Honestly, blue looks good with brown, so I'm gonna go with the brown. Again, temporary. Blue hat to match. And handwear if we need it. Black gloves, maybe. Those are skeleton. I think we'll go with black gloves, unless we go with brown gloves to match, but they don't really match, do they? We'll just do the black ones. There we go. Confirm. I'm surprised they won't let they don't let you change your hairstyle later. That seems kind of kind of silly. All right, just kind of brief sum up if you guys want to read it. Man, anybody? You ready to work? I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Little I can gather is that your partners are alive. For now. Seems they've been split up. Each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back, I get it. I get it. I got friends that have been taken too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're going to do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. All right, well, get a couple of goodies here. All the things. Be careful out there. It's crawling with Peggy's. Those fuckers are willing to die for that psychopath that's leading them. All right, man. Thanks for the warning. Let's get out of here and start cleansing. Now, I played this this bit. Uh, what do we have for stuff? We actually don't have any melee, so let's grab it. Again, we're allowed three different things. Three different weapons for now. That could change. Ooh, step into the to the wilderness. Now listen up. If you're gonna build a resistance, there's some things you need to know. There's four ways you can go about this. First, you can liberate any hostages the cult's taken. These are good people. We might just fight alongside you if you help them. Second, you can destroy Eden's Gate property that's all over the place now. Hell, they built two goddamn shrines on this island alone. Third, you can tackle resistance missions. There are a lot of folks out there waging their own war against this cult. And they could sure use your help. And last, if you're really looking for a fight, you can take on the cult outposts that have popped up across the county. Liberating those 
places will give the Resistance solid footholds to push back against Eden's Gate. All right. So these are things we got to do now. Now, if we go to the map, this is Dutch's Island right here. This little tiny bit. We don't. We can't zoom out any further than this right now. Where this is basically like the tutorial island. So we just got to look around and see what we can do. So really, we're just gonna explore and help out civilians, destroy the property, etc., etc. So let me ask something. Hold on a second. The resistance. All right, so. Let's go. Now, I think we there's actually a guy. Because I did play this bit. So, I'm going to scout it from here. I think there's only the two of them. So, it's pretty straightforward. We're just going to flank. I'm actually going to go stealth, so, obviously, so I'm going to switch up Sinner, you to the pipe. What you know. I actually don't think the guy in front will ever see you. Dibs? Where's the deputy hiding? Uh, Woo! You alright, man? Thanks for saving my story. Oh, it's my pleasure. These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boat house. Should have some good gear squirreled away. Thanks. Alright, so that's something we've unlocked. We can go over there. We're gonna go mark it. Just keep an eye out for any members of the resistance and etc, etc. Alright. Tried to get the underground stash, but a pipe burst and flooded everything. I have no idea what's still salvageable. We need juice to run that pump to drain the water. I know the power switch is in the boathouse, but it's locked, and you didn't leave me a key. So I'll leave that up to you. So, uh, we'll try... Oh, wait. Damn it. Sorry. Alright, so we're gonna head over there. One second. Journal, right? See, it's considered... It's a stash, right? So... So I remember how to get into it. Everything is locked out, so you have to actually enter from the water or from the ceiling. Was it the ceiling or the water? I actually think it was the water. Yes, because the door is locked. This was causing a problem. All right, that activates the pump. Goodies, rifle, arrows. All right. Head back up. All right. Daddy's home. All right, this will be free and clear in a moment. It's really crowded, though, isn't it? Like, it seems really cramped in here. Alright, everything you possibly need. All the money. Damn. Okay. Crossbow. This thing is dope. All right, so yeah, for making crafting stuff. At the moment, I only have one slot, so I'm gonna keep the compound bow because I prefer the stealth and the quietness of it. All right, so what's next? We gotta keep looking around. I don't think we can actually track anything. I think we just gotta keep walking. So just follow the routes because there's only a couple. I love how Dutch needed you to do the thing. You know, like, he's like, oh, yeah, there's crazies out here, but I've been steering clear of them. All right, hang tight. 
I'm gonna need a better, uh, a better sight here. Oh, I'm getting spotted briefly. Is that guy dead? Alright, so I can flank. I'm gonna go around uh, around the back and maybe hop in through the house. Or maybe the rooftop would be better. I can take him out from from the window. That was come on, that's dank. The guy across the way might be a problem. I'm wondering if I should take to the roof. I don't know, actually. Okay, <coughs> good. Seriously, thank you. We're still good. Look at this. Please don't turn around, for the love of God. Damn, that was clean, and it was undetected. You get a bonus for that, don't you? Now this is a new spawn point for us, and I think they'll have side missions here as well. Bingo, bingo, bingo. It's kind of, that, the music's kind of a hybrid between like, country and like, Indian. Have you noticed that? Yeah, see, we get, what do you know? I just saw the cult grab a guy down by the docks. You help him out, and maybe he'd be willing to pick up a gun and return the favor. Yes, guns for hire. All right, we're going to go ahead and do that. Can I not talk to you? Like, do you not want to talk? No. All right, so we still got to liberate the island. Let's go to the journal again. This is essentially the same thing. It counts towards it. So, and then yeah, you can get people to come with you. You can, I think you have a, you can have a squad of about three, and some of them are special units, while some are more regular. All right, there he is. There, I think it's just the lone guy. I could be wrong, so I'm actually going to approach from the rocky cliffs off to the side here, just to give us a better. And then I think yeah, like I said, I'm pretty sure there's only one. Come on, let me up there. Don't be a douche. But again, there, yeah, no, there's this chick. I knew there was a second. Just making sure everything's going over fine. I could snipe her in the face, but... I don't know. There's nothing like going up and flanking them. You know, getting real personal on it. Saving that ammo. Don't hear me. They won't be long for this world. Nope. Just like you! And this guy, we're going to do a from below level. And grab him, pull him into the water. Where's the deputy hiding? Right here. Woo! Hey, How you doing, man? Are you all right? Quick and quiet. Thank you, deputy. You look pretty beaten up. You want to join me? All right. I've got a bone to pick with that car. So they all have bonuses as well, each one of these guys. So at, once we get five kills with him, we'll unlock a special ability. Get 12, we unlock another one. So let's rock and roll, my man. Hey, deputy. Now that you're partnered up, the day you should head to the forest research station. I'm Don't on it. They're crawling all over that place, using it as a depot for their goddamn bliss. Clear them all out. Send a message. We're not fucking around anymore. Okay, relax. Let's try and do this nice and quiet. Actually, I should have read that. Cult is up ahead. Stay low. Now, I remember there being way more guys than the, than it originally looks. So, I want to try and do this. See, this is the unique part about playing this. Already, this bit. Okay, move, dude. Come on. Oh, there he is. Okay. I don't want to use the zip line. It's going to be too loud. 
Oh shit. Again? Again, not what I wanted to do. I didn't mean to use the zip line. Fuck, dude. Damn, what's going on? He's going loud. He doesn't know I'm there. Hit him. Oh, he's hidden. He's hidden. Hold on. So we're not going to get the stealth thing here, but... He's down. I don't have a shot. Right in the back. I think that's the lot. Yes, it is. You okay, my man? Good job clearing out the research station. Peggy's won't be back after the ass whooping you just laid on him. While you're there, check around and see if any folks are left alive. Oh yeah, well, they are, man. They tied them up. I think I thought there was something I could read. Yeah, this right here. All right, cult shrine. So this is something we got to try and destroy, if I remember correctly. It's talking about a shrine. If you destroy it. Shit, kid. I'm impressed. There's more fighting you than I thought. Sorry, I'm just gonna mark the next one. We know where it is. We're gonna go take it out. Got a real shot at setting up this resistance. Next step is clearing up the radio signal. My CB's on the fritz. I can't get a hold of anyone off this island. The radio tower near the south shore must be busted. You think you can take care of that for me? Sure, man. It's nice to have somebody with you, though. Ah, damn. Do I swim? Can I swim faster? Yeah. So I'm gonna just, I am gonna destroy this area. Alright, flanking around the back. Now, we just gotta blow that up, but I know there's a few guys here. Obviously. Okay, come on. Really? Are you serious? Get up. Ah, oh, I can't! What's going on? Jesus. Oh my god, I can't go anywhere. They're like, nope, don't go. Oh, shit. Just take him down, please. That can't be good. I can't believe he survived the first hit. Oh, don't be too close. That angel dust. Let's do a death from above. He's not looking anymore. Yes! A very palpable hit! Dude, watch out! Understood. Go, man. Maybe we need a gun. There you go. Don't mess around. Just, just pop the domes. All right, I'm good. All right, let's head on over. The radio tower. I think once we get that going... Will be golden delicious apples. All right, let's first reach into this. I actually don't believe there's anybody here. We just got to get up to the top of the the towers. Now they had something similar like for this in the last one. Oh wait, no, not yet. Sorry, just climb the ladder. It was actually not in the last one. Far Cry 4. I don't want to say primal because they didn't have, but it's the, it's the tower thing, right? That shows you the area of the land. The lay of the land unlocks the the stuff. I know what you're thinking, and no, I ain't gonna have you climbing towers all over the county for me. Don't <laughs> worry. Also, try not to fall from up there. See, that's poking fun at that. You're not gonna have to do it, but I'm sure it will be. How else are you going to unlock all the areas? You know what I mean? There 
There you go, that's a level up. Now we get our first perk. Right? I'm getting a strong signal now. Let's open up your map. I'll walk you through what I'm hearing. Let's look at the big picture. Assume your map out so we can see the whole county. Now, Hope County is divided into three regions. To the north, you got the Whitetail Mountains. It's run by Jacob Seed, oldest brother of that fucking family. Jacob's the one training the cult, and he's damn good at what he does. Eli and the Whitetail Militia have been trying to hold out, but Jacob's ready to step on their necks. Southeast of there, you got the Henbane River. That's face territory. The little sister. I've heard all sorts of stories about people losing their minds in a place called the Bliss. Now, head west to the Holland Valley. John Seeds just rolled in there and has taken everything in the name of the cult. Food, supplies, and worst of all, people. Now, they're gonna have plenty more calls all over the county. I'll keep you posted on anything that'll be useful. All right, so it doesn't really matter who I go to first, but I'm thinking... All right, so now what we got, I guess we could, you know, do a little bit of stuff, but the goal is to get your enough level in each region where you can uh, take, eventually take them out. And then once we're done with these guys, we'll get to the man himself. Joseph, or not, sorry, not Joseph. All right, Joseph, yeah, Joseph. He's right here, this is his place. So we'll unlock that later. So. If we go ahead and look at the, uh... Fog should be clearing soon, which means we can get you off this island. Sit tight. Shouldn't be much longer. Alright, so we can pretty... Again, the fog will clear. We can do what we need to. The spark. Oh, shit. Deputy, I'm picking up something new out of Holland Valley. It's a broadcast from John. You need to see this. We are all sinners. Every one of us. You, me. <laughs> Even the Father knows deeply of sin. It's a poison that clouds our minds. What if I told you you could be free from sin? What if I told you that everything you ever dreamed could come true? What if I told you that everything could be overcome if you embraced an idea? freedom from sin can come from the power of just one word. Watching this, know that you have been selected. You will be cleansed, you will confess your sins, and you will be offered atonement. Don't worry. You don't have to do anything. We'll come for you. Welcome to Eden's Gate. Damn, if that's not propaganda, I don't know what is. I am still unable to take control of my character. Fuck. Thank you. John C has got your partner, Hudson. She's in a world of shit, kid. You gotta get going. Alright, well. Okay, now we can actually move, yeah? Okay, cool. So I'm just gonna go up and check the map. Real quick. Um, so these are the current missions. The Barren Lumber Mill, which... See, yeah, the Henbane River is uh, Faith's area, and then Jacob's is up here. So I'm kind of thinking I might start with the Baron Lumber Mill. It's a bit closer. Um, any side missions? Not at the moment. So now what? Um, before I leave, I have one perk. Oh, I don't have any perks. Oh, I thought I did. Oh, 
All right. Well, anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and split this video here. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you haven't yet, be sure to like and follow my pages on social media. Facebook.com slash DanQ8000 for live streams and other content. Twitter, DanQ8000. Instagram, DanQ8K. Snapchat, DanQ8000. If you want to get yourself a shirt or hoodie, there's a link to my shop in the description below. If you want to save 10%, off a DX racer chair. There's a link in the description. Be sure to use the promo code DanQ8000 at checkout. All right, guys, thank you so much again. Take it easy. Have a wonderful day. I'll be seeing you soon for more content. But until then, let's hand things over to Knox Hill. Have a good one, guys. Who's the man with the plan? Hmm. If you feel trouble, wild and wild, don't need violin and hit Q8000. Wait a minute, hold that style and style. Dan, goddamn Billy Jack, we still riding tires flat. I hear them sirens, see shots flying, so we driving fire back. If they ain't vibing, lie with that. Got me dressed up in all black. What up? Hood up, and I see them haters try to run with us, and don't need inhalers. Gotta breathe them hard, just like the beta players. Grab your respirators, night invaders get life savored. Mass on for the shooters, move like trash to Bed intruder, got that glocking, got them woofers, just press play, I'll keep it moving, who is Knox, till you damn fools, keep it fresh like canned food, there ain't nothing we can't do, so tune into that damn Q. Yeah, it was never, ever a game.